Hi everyone and welcome back to another video. In this short tutorial I'm going to be showing you how you can make these animated backgrounds from scratch that you can use in your presentation or output to video for social media. So let's jump straight into it. As usual the first thing we'll do is start off with a blank presentation. So we'll go file, new, blank presentation, right click, layout and choose blank. I'll zoom out a little, holding down control and using the mouse wheel. Now we want to go to the drawing section in the home part of the ribbon and choose curve. For this we can click anywhere down the bottom and drag. And each time I click and let go it will draw a smooth curve. When you press enter it will be finished. You can draw this however you want and you can also even right click on it and choose edit points and make any adjustments to the curve you want later on. It doesn't really matter for this example, you can draw anything you like that looks good. I'll now move it up into the corner and press Ctrl D and then drag this anywhere. So each time pressing Ctrl D to make a copy, putting it anywhere you want and then I'll select all of them with Ctrl A and Ctrl D again to make more copies. Ctrl D again, and just drag these into position. We're going to size them up and rotate them in a minute. Each time you press Ctrl D, it will make copies for you. I'll use Ctrl and the mouse wheel to zoom out a bit more. Ctrl A to select all these, Ctrl G to group, rotate them so they're in line with what I want. Drag them into position. I can Ctrl D again to make some more. That's about right. Now I can right click, go to format shape. I'm going to make these five wide, but you can choose anything you think looks good. And right click and choose format background. I'm going to choose a gradient fill, drag these stops off, select black for both of these. And then just adjust the brightness on the top one. For the colour of these lines, I'm going to set it to black. I'm just going to add a few more lines to this before we move it. So Control Shift G will ungroup. Then I can pick up this and Control D to duplicate. Control G to group everything. I just want to size this up very slightly so it covers the whole screen. I'm just quickly moving these so there's no overlaps. Control A and Control G will group them all. All we basically want is as it moves from left to right, it covers the entire screen. I'm actually going to flip these and rotate them. So I can go to Arrange, Rotate and choose Flip Vertical. And make sure that they cover the whole screen. And now when they drag from left to right, you'll see they cover everything. So I'm just quickly going to add the box that I had for text. I'm going to make this fig tree extra bold. 80 point font size, black, shape fill, white and shape outline, no outline and align it to the middle. That looks great, now let's add the animation and then I'll quickly show you how you can output it to video. So for the animation, I'll click on these lines, go to animations, add animation, motion path, the default is to move it down, but I want it to go to the left, so I'll go to effect options and choose left. That looks good, I just wanted to move a bit further, and to do that we can click on the red arrow, it becomes a red dot, click on the red dot and then drag it to the left, holding down shift, which will keep its Y position locked. When we play this, it will be very fast. So it's fast because the default duration is two seconds on a motion path. We can change that to something a lot longer. And if we want it to be very long, such as two minutes, I can double click this in the animation pane. Go to timing, duration two, colon zero zero, press return. It will actually show as auto in this timing. 
but when you double click on it, you will see under timing that it's set it to two minutes. I'll now take the smooth end down to zero and the smooth start down to zero and press OK. Finally, I'll make it start with previous so it starts as we enter the slide. And now when I play that, we've got a very slow, smooth animation. We can quickly and easily make variations of this. Control D to duplicate the slide. Click on your lines. Make them any colour outline you want, for example blue. Then right click on the background, format background. Change this gradient to any colour you want. Adjust the brightness for the look you're going for. Change the text colour. And there's your quick and easy variation. Finally, I'll show you how you can quickly output this to video. So for example, if we just wanted the black one, we could go to that, go to File, Export, Create a Video, choose Ultra HD, the amount of seconds spent on the slide. For example, if you just wanted a 30 second video, we could type 30 and then Create Video. We can give it a name and then click Export. You'll see at the bottom a progress bar so you can see when it's finished exporting. While that's going, you can even carry on editing this presentation. Now my video is finished exporting, it should say video exported successfully and you can click to view the video. Great, so now you've got a quickly made video that you can upload to any of your socials and you can go in and edit it at any point quickly and easily directly in PowerPoint and make different variations. Thanks very much for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you'd like to see more, hit subscribe. If you like the video, smash that like button and I'll see you in the next one.